Watchman number one. Thank you. Two. What's good, comic book fans, comic book addicts? Welcome back to another comic book haul. We're going to start things off with a collaboration between Marvel and Paramount Comics. This is Star Trek and X-Men. This is much harder to find. And we have a couple of these uh, manga, Spider-Man goodness. See, that's issue 9, 10, 11. I really like this cover right here. Definitely manga, Japanese, uh, Peter Parker, 13, 14. I can read a little bit of that because... Japanese borrowed from the country, borrows from Chinese uh, words. And 15 with Mysterio right there. It's beautiful. Star Masters number one. This is the first issue featuring the first team appearance of Star Masters, which consists of Beta Ray Bill, Silver Surfer, and Quasar. Are you tired of your water not being cold enough, especially when you are training hard at the gym or on a hot summer day? With the Coldest Water 21 ounce sports bottle, you can properly hydrate yourself while cooling down your body because it's built for athletes and high performers looking for the best water bottle. It has the proprietary fully insulated 2.0 lid technology which keeps water colder longer. You never have to buy another water bottle again with the Coldest Water. So cold and so refreshing. Here's some Meteor Man goodness. I think this is volume two of the Meteor Man number one. You don't see that every day, Meteor Man. Captain America number eight featuring the uh, first appearance of Bran Shaw, who is a Kree warrior. I actually got two of these. Okay. So especially with Secret Invasions, you know, Kree vs. Skrull, it should be hot. Homage Studios number one, J. Scott Campbell's first work. Uh, yeah, also Brett Booth's first work. Avengers number eight, first appearance of Triathlon. Triathlon, you see right in the cover right there. Number 17 is Hot Red She Hulk versus uh, Red Hulk. That might be the first uh, time they battle. Here's a Nemesis from Mark Millarverse. Nemesis. And here's Wool, number two. I heard Wool might be an upcoming uh, uh, TV show. Oh, this is the rare Harley Quinn violent cover. Sure. Scarce. Oh, it's a banjo movie. Ooh. Star Trek X Men crossover. And this yeah. this one be banjo movie. Red Shield or this Red Hope. Catwoman number 82. This is controversial, hard to find, controversial, violent cover. You see. She has her throat slit and she's bleeding out. New X-Men. This is the first appearance of Blimp, Fender, F Fader, G-Type, ne Necrosis, Plutonia, and Schism. Just the America number 52. This might be an unofficial first appearance of Dark Supergirl. That's the first time me's ever seen it. War War Hulk Avengers the Initiative number 5. You see Hulk laying on the cover right there. This is the um, the first full appearance of Mutant Zero. And here's a controversial issue. Let me throw some Avengers. Come on, big money. Oh, this is a controversial issue. Where Henry Prim shrinks down to have sex with his wife, Janet Dye. Controversial issue. Featuring where uh, Henry Pym, Hank Pym, shrunk down size to have intimate relations with uh, the Wasp. Team appearance of the Winter Guard. Yeah, I couldn't believe my eyes when I just saw these. By the way, these are 40 cents each. 
three of these Iron Man featuring a Mandarin on the cover and this first appearance for this is the first uh, team appearance of Winter Guard. Here's an Adam Hughes beautiful cover right there. Goodness, right here. This looks really super mad. Come on, big money. Big money. <gasps> First appearance of mine, girl. Superman 170 featuring the first appearance of Mangal. Mangal was in uh, Suicide Squad 2. Fortunately, she died. <laughs> J2. Issue number six. Uh, this is the first appearance of Magneto, female Magneto in the Ultimate Universe, I guess. New Avengers number seven. This is the, where Maquanda declares war on Atlantis, so we have Black Panther versus Namor. Neo number one. Um, don't know much about Neo, but all I know is that it's autographed and acclaimed comic, so it's based on a video game. It must be a 90s goodness right there. The Batman Chronicles number 21. This is the first published work by Brian Michael Bendis for DC Comics. Speaking of DC Comics, we got Batman Returns. I highly suggest watching The Batman. Even though it's a very long movie, it was quite good. I feel that it's the second best Batman movie of all time. And The Penguin, whoever uh, did The Penguin, did a lot of justice. And Catwoman was... Oh, they, so they're pretty much they're rehashing this. Here's all new X Men. Uh, this is the, what's this called? This is the Comic Con box exclusive. I got it for twenty five cents too. Don't have to worry about removing the annoying price sticker because it's already back and bought. So here's another comic block. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles B Bob exclusive right there. Okay, and let's look through these clearance comics. Oh snap! Never seen this UFC before. Bruce Lee. Cyberpunk, Death of Robin, a whole bunch of Street Fighter comics, look at this, Star Wars variant, Fan Expo, all these comic block exclusives, grabbing all of these, Thor 2, 25 cents, let's get it. Continue on with more exciting even nerd block comic block goodness so we have masked for 25 cents you can't go wrong guys you don't even have to remove the price sticker it's already bag and pretty much border and can also action this shape vikings number one with nerd block so that's uprising we got red sonia number one presented by nerd block pacific realm pretty nice movie tales from the drift comic block now here's a beautiful one. Look at New York Comic Con exclusive Revolution Transformers. Look at how this is packed. Wow. These will make great gifts too. And speaking of that, look at this. X-Files comic block. So thick too. I think there's cardboard in there. Wow. Couldn't believe it. A Star Wars comic and it's a fan expo for a dollar variant. I mean for 25 cents. Can't go wrong with that. Hold on, let me give you a sneak peek at what this is all about. What's inside this comic? Oh, it's actually a very good art. Nice story too. Yeah. Alright, looking for these Dark Horse Presents comics. Some old ones right here. Oh, what's these right here? Look at this. First appearance of aliens. First battle of aliens predator. And first apple seed. Alright, it's not often that I pay a whole much to Dark Horse Comics, but this is the uh, first first battle between Avenger, I mean <laughs> Aliens vs Predator. And here we have the origin of the aliens. Oh, that's the Xenomorphs. Okay. Apple C number one. I just figure, you know, Apple C, they might decide to do some justice, bring it back, revamp it. Book one, volume one. 
Alright, I'm looking for these comics. Sandman. Oh, this one, the first appearance in Daniel Hall is Sandman, Dream, the Saint Dream, Steven's Universe, variant cover. Here is Sandman number 69. That's an easy number to remember because this features the uh, first uh, full appearance of Daniel Hall as a new dream. Can't wait for the upcoming uh, Netflix uh, Sandman series. Wonder Woman number 50. This is celebration issue. And Alright, I'm looking for these Wonder Woman comics. Oh, snap, number one. Number 50. Wonder Woman number one. Uh, George Perez, classic cover. And Steven Universe. This is the variant cover of the premiere issue, Steven Universe. All right, so some more clearance goodness. There aren't any really major keys. Some things I just wanted. I was think I was going for like a Thor set right here just to read. See that? Got Doctor Doom. Doctor Doom again. I don't know who that is, but he's stepping on Thor. Beat, beat his ass. Thor to see 607. Here's 609. I like this fiery cover. 612. 613. 616. And we have... Uh, Odin. I was just about to say Zeus. I meant Odin. Yeah. Thor goodness and I'm kind of collecting these spoof comics so instead of Watchmen it's called What Men from IDW What Men <laughs> and here's the Vampirella goodness look at this number one special edition Anthony Marks Dynamite exclusive and the sign too see that for 25 cents and it features a certificate of authenticity oh my goodness it doesn't say how many copies there are but I would guess probably under 2,000 copies. And here's Cyberpunk. They might revamp that as a new movie. And lastly, for 25 cents, you can't beat the Legion of Superheroes 38 featuring the death of Superboy. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, take care of yourselves. Happy hunting.